Okie dokie, so um, I drag and drop the video file into Adobe Audition CC and it'll load a little quiet so I'm just going to bring up the volume first um, and look for an area of silence um, which I know represents just the hiss that we want to get rid of so that's a pretty good example there's a breath in there, I think I'll go for this one, that should do it um, so I select that range, right click and capture the noise print uh, then I deselect um, so that the effect I'm about to apply doesn't just apply to that selected area but instead the whole file so effects, noise reduction, noise reduction and I fiddled with these settings quite a lot and I, with this audio, thought this worked nicely um, reduce by is the most simple of the four main ones um, so the, probably between 10 and 20 decibels is how much you want to reduce the hiss once you've isolated it um, and you isolate it uh, with these sort of three here uh, so smoothing and transition width make quite a big difference and I think they want to be that kind of ratio and probably to be honest not much different to these numbers uh, and noise reduction is kind of the trade-off between how sort of more noise reduction will get rid of the hiss more but sort of make it sound a bit more robotic and metallic and um, just too aggressive reduction um, so I tend to sort of uh, make this more and more subtle until I can definitely hear the hiss but it's not annoying and that's the kind of um, sweet spot halfway house that you want to go for so let's have a listen. I think that, I think that sounds pretty good um, and then once that's applied you may want to do stuff with the EQ um, if it sort of sounds a little bit tinny because um, sometimes you can lose bass when the microphone isn't right up close to someone's mouth you just get the sort of high end uh, so you may want to just kind of boost a bit of the um, lower end of the vocals which I think um, you know with children is going to be higher pitched than with adults um, and girls also have higher pitched um, vocals but uh, I think it's around the sort of 10,000 hertz 10 kilohertz range, um, sort of yeah, about 8 to 10 kilohertz. I think that's the sort of main vocals range for females. Males slightly lower, um, but yeah, may not be necessary to do that.